hello. Today's review is on um, the Maltese Falcon, uh, starring Humphrey Bogart. Um, <laughs> um, Bob Dickey, Sydney Green Street, Peter, um, Lori, Alicia Cook Jr. And what else? Somebody else is in this. It's, her name is in the front, but covered by the sticker. So Mary. Who? Mary who? Um. I don't know. Mary who? That's gonna bother me now. What's her name? I need a lot. Chris is in the cover in the back. We can't get her name. Mary Asher thing? Yeah, I think that's it. I don't know. But. Anyways. Um, Maltese Falcon. This is a remake of another of uh, another version. I don't know that there was like another version besides this. But so, um, like I said, when I got this from the library, when I go back um, to the library, I'm going to get the original one, and then I'm going to do like a compare contrast type of thing. So, yeah. But um, Peter Lorre was adorable in this. You guys got to say he had curly hair, and he was like, it wasn't his first movie, but, you know, it was like the beginning of his career, and he is just, Adorable. I and mean, then this is Sydney Greenstreet's first movie ever. And then he did Casablanca with uh, Humphrey and Peter. And he did nine movies with Peter Lorre. Uh, Sydney Greenstreet did. Um, Sydney started his career really late in life, but he had a really good career. So, um, it's good. Um,. He got into acting because he was doing a job and he got bored, so he decided to go. He was on stage for or like 40 years before he did uh, movies, so he did act. He did. He had some experience on stage, but he just did it because he got bored one day. And that's what happened. <laughs> so, thank God he got bored because he was a good actor. Um, but Humphrey Bogart is so young in this. That I didn't, when it first started, I almost didn't recognize him because he just, uh, he looked so different in this. And then, I don't know when Casablanca was shot, but he looks completely different in Casablanca. And the hat that he wore in, um, Casablanca is the, he wore that same hat in, like, most of his movies. Um, it was his hat, let's just say. Um. Back in the day, studios didn't always have the budget or the money to give actors costumes. So a lot of the time, the actors had to bring their own clothes. And so Humphrey wore a lot of his own like jackets and hats and clothes in his movies. Um, so there you go, little fact. Uh, yeah, but it was so, so good. There was a part where Peter Lorre and Sidney Gunshi are mean to Humphrey, and I was like, what are you doing? You're his friends. Like, no. <laughs> I, was kind of, I was like, Peter Lorre, no. We're not supposed to do that. But, um, I've mentioned this before, but it's talking about Humphrey and Peter again, so, you know. But Humphrey didn't like people, um, but he liked Peter. And he liked Sydney. Like, he liked people who were not, like, overly Hollywood. And he didn't like fake people. And, like, he in Hollywood, a lot of fake people. But Sydney and Peter, they're not from, they were not from America in the first place. They're from, uh, you know, other countries. And they came over here. So they were kind of, like, I guess a little more real and they've experienced more of the world so he kind of liked them a little bit more because they weren't like Hollywood people. They are real people I, think, I guess you could say. Um, and they were nice. Like Peter was loved by so many people and Humphrey liked him and um, Peter encouraged him to be with Lauren Bacall so I think Humphrey liked him a lot more after that. Um, 
But it just, Humphrey just didn't like a lot of people. Because, like I said, a lot of fakeness in Hollywood. Like, people were saying, oh, yeah, this person is gay. And he's like, no, they're not. Like, he just did not sugarcoat how he felt. And, um, got a lot of people upset. But then the people who did know him, he was, he was good to them. He was very good to them. So, yeah. Um... I have one more video. I thought I had three videos planned today. I think I do have another one. <laughs> I'm not sure how that's going to go though. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm going to go now. So, mm.